Welcome. So what I have here is 11 pi divided by 4. And what I want to do is show you how to sketch the angle 11 pi over 4. So um, this time a lot of it gets a little confusing when we have this large numerator because this is going to be over at least one revolution. So a couple things just to remember at least when we're looking at, I think a sneeze is coming on. Hold on. No, maybe. I think I hold it. OK. So if we have our initial side, remember the rotation of a ray halfway around a circle is going to be pi. But what I like to do when I'm sketching an angle is I always look at my denominator and say, all right, well, halfway around a circle would be 4 pi over 4. right? Because 4 pi over 4 is the exact same thing as pi. But I like to take the denominator of the angle that I'm going to sketch and rewrite it as halfway in there. So then I know that I'm breaking up half of my circle into fours. 1 fourth, 2 fourths, 3 fourths, 4 fourths. Right? But we notice in this example that this is positive. So therefore, we need to go counterclockwise, which is the positive direction, because counterclockwise would be in the negative direction. So let's go and just get a fresh circle here. And we know that we're going to break it up into force. And we're going to break this down into force as well. All right? So we always start at our initial side, our, our initial side, which is going to be on the x-axis. And now we're just going to rotate our rays. Now remember, this is 4 pi over 4. Well, if I go to 4 pi over 4 and I go over and I keep on counting, so break this up into 4. So 4 pi over 4, 5 pi, 6 pi, 7 pi, 8 pi. So then a whole revolution of a circle in terms of force would be 8 pi over 4, which reduces down to 2 pi. So therefore, I start here. And we're just going to keep on counting until we get to 11 pi over 4. So 1 pi over 4, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi, 5 pi, 6 pi, 7 pi, 8 pi. 9 pi, 10 pi, 11 pi over 4. So you can see the rotation of this ray started here, and then here would be your terminal side, and we went in the positive direction. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you sketch 11 pi over 4. Thanks. What you working on now? <laughs>